tattooing to me is something that's just, it's a unique craft and it's something that I love to do. And if I'm successful in life, you know, having a career in an avenue that I'm, I love, that's a blessing. And, and really, you know, it's the innovation side of it, following rules, but having creative freedom. So that's when collaboration kind of struck an interest in me and found out how amazing it is to work with other breweries. We get to put our, our thoughts together, um, but in a perfect world, we're gonna learn something and we're gonna bond. And I'm gonna be better friends with Jack and Casey and his brewing, their brewing team today than I was yesterday. My name is Casey Harris, uh, brewmaster for Topa Topa and uh, co-founder. Firestone's um, always been probably one of my favorite uh, craft breweries. It was kind of my intro to craft beer. All through the years of working with Topa, we've always wanted to do something with Firestone. And we just had the opportunity in this bigger facility to uh, push out a collab. Really excited just to get together and brew with Firestone. Well, we got the brewers of Topa Topa up here adding a little bit of rice hole since we're using so much uh, wheat malt for this beer. But we're gonna mash in turn number two for the day. So it's go time. Once we started talking about what kind of beer we wanted to make, it's a hat tip to Pale 31 and that we're using a lot of the same raw materials, very similar hops and having the same hop profiles. We're modernizing the beer by doing it in a East Coast or hazy style uh, pale ale. We just really wanted to do a beer that was up to date of that version, still be really relevant um, in the new scene of craft with all the hazy beers, but really pay homage to the Central Coast. You know, I'm a big fan of collaborations. Um, I've done a few in my years, and they've really been good opportunities to get to know uh, your comrades in the brewing industry. And really, it's also a good opportunity for brewers to get together, um, talk recipe formulation, talk process and uh, execution. And hopefully, I'm gonna learn something from them today. They're gonna learn something from us today. And not only are we able to put our minds together to create a really good beer, but we'll have some knowledge uh, from the day that we could take home and perhaps utilize in our own facilities, in our own careers, and make better beer because of it.